S Plus J House is located in the seaside neighborhood Costa Esmeralda, a private development 13 kilometer north of the city of Pinamar and four hours away from Buenos Aires City. Despite being almost plain, the plot of land slopes softly towards its back. As the studio proposed to preserve the lot's dense pine grove, only the trees on the construction site were removed in order to build the house. The client, a group of two families, requested a house that could lodge both at the same time and that could be rented out. The commission consisted of a recreation house built entirely out of exposed concrete with minimalist interior spaces and little maintenance requirements. In order to preserve the native vegetation, the house was set longitudinally and the setback on the front and the sides was expanded beyond the minimum required by code. By so doing, the house ended up surrounded by pines. At half height of the entrance level and set on the natural terrain, the platform at the back houses the social area, which opens into a terrace overlooking the golf court behind the plot of land. Following regulating lines, an orthogonal grid organizes the house's structure and space. The house is arranged in two staggered platforms disposed at half height and connected through smoothly sloped ramp-like stairs and an empty space in which the pine forest becomes a part of the house. In an elementary architectural scheme, Synthesized in two platforms connected by bridges and green patios, a continuum stripe made of concrete swathes the whole house, thus producing a single volume, composed of void and filled areas, that at once shelters the interior space from the outside view and preserves its intimacy without dissociating the house from the nature around. The brief included two ensuite bedrooms with their own closets and two cabin-like minimum rooms sharing a bathroom. So as to make the social area the most important place in the house, an external expansion was requested. Also, the client asked for a closed space for beach vehicles and a semi-covered area parking lot. Special emphasis was laid on the need to establish a fluid relation between the inner spaces and the exterior which would allow a closer experience of the forest.